New in theaters this week is Last Vegas, and if anything else, it's proof that there are more talented actors than there are good scripts to accommodate them. Uh, it just occurred to me that at the end of last year, we got a movie called Stand Up Guys, you've probably already forgotten it, that starred Al Pacino, Christopher Walken, and Alan Arkin in a very forgettable gangster comedy. And this year, we get Michael Douglas, Robert De Niro, Morgan Freeman, and Kevin Kline in a very forgettable senior citizen bonding comedy about four lifelong friends now in their 70s who gather in Sin City to throw a bachelor party. Uh, the movie is pretty lame and contrived, and about the only thing it has going for it is the aggregate charm that Douglas, De Niro, Klein, and Freeman bring to the project. They each get their moments to shine. I mean, you're not going to see a Morgan Freeman dance number again anytime soon, I suspect. Uh, but I just wish the movie were stronger and better and more worthy of their talents. Um, there's an old Roger Ebert line about, is this movie more fun than watching the people in it having lunch? And I suspect the lunches on this set were a lot better than the movie. Judge for yourself. In the meantime, you can check out my review of Las Vegas at TheWrap.com.